Escrow is a, a system whereby you have a, a counterparty that you trust that acts as an intermediary in the transaction. So essentially, instead of uh, the recipient authorizing the transaction, it takes the recipient plus your third party to authorize the transaction. This is usually implemented with multi-sig, which means that instead of one signature required to redeem the transaction, you need two signatures within that same transaction. One is the signature of the recipient, the, the address you sent the money to, and the other one is the signature of a third party. That third party could be an organization that, that for example, provides you with a guarantee for a small fee, that they won't actually release the money until both sender and recipient have agreed, or until the product you ordered is actually delivered. And they might have um, some kind of offline arbitration process or legal process that backs that up. Um, with multi-sig, you can do even more interesting things, uh, which is you can do escrow on a peer-to-peer -peer basis. You could get together, for example, with five of your friends and split your Bitcoin in such a way that it takes uh, three out of five signatures to redeem any of it. So that uh, as long as uh, as long as you know you have to get three of your friends together to, to spend any of the money, but that way all of you do this in a reciprocal arrangement, and your money can't be stolen because it takes three. And even if two of them get run over by buses, <laughs> you still have the other three. So uh, so your money is even more secure than your friends. <laughs> yeah, sure. Go ahead. I would like to ask you uh, to elaborate a little bit more about you mentioned about this uh, split in 2016. I was uh, expecting in 2015. And the next question: What would be the next higher algorithm of the Bitcoin? Like Bitcoin has the algorithm SHA-256. Right. What would be the higher? Okay. Okay. So the the first one is um, yeah. I'm not sure it's in. 2016, because it doesn't depend on the date. It depends on whether 806,400 blocks have been mined since the last division. So it's it depends on how fast the blocks are mined. So because the uh, retargeting algorithm is always retrospective, based on the average of the previous two weeks, for the last two years we've been running ahead of schedule. So instead of blocks being mined every 10 minutes. The difficulty is never quite catching up, and you'll see that the average time is sometimes between six and eight minutes, uh, which means we're mining blocks faster than, than expected, because the growth of hashing uh, has shot through the roof very fast. So what, do you, 